Hey, check it out. You can call me Fromona. Hey y'all, I'm James Wright and welcome to my shop. This last week has been a one for the record books, a fantastic, wonderful week. Um, two videos I got out, number one, the next step on the dresser. So how do you make the drawers, put them in and fit them all? That was a, a great one to have and this dresser project should be rolling along. So hopefully I'm gonna be doing a video here soon on um, doing a lot of the finishing touches I'm um, doing the top and then in video on the actual finishing process. So hopefully in the next few weeks, the dresser will actually be done. But uh, famous last words, we'll see how that goes. Uh, the second video happened to fall on April 1st. Um, so I had to do something fun for that. So I actually did a uh, cooking with hand tools video, uh, kind of slapstick, but a lot of fun and uh, some interesting things in it. Um, I got a lot of great feedback and apparently people really like that video. So uh, if you want to check out either of those, you can see them up in the cards. The big thing from this last week was going down to Atlanta for the woodworking shows, and that was an absolute blast. Uh, there were over 80 YouTube channels that were there. I uh, got to hang out and uh, spend some time and meet fans and other things like that. It was just a really, really wonderful time. So if you got to be there, I was glad to meet you. Um, maybe next year, I think we're going to be doing uh, St. Louis next year because it's a little more centralized. But uh, we will see. So, yeah, I also added a whole lot of stickers to the sticker wall. And, <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, I'm going to have to make another panel here soon. The really big thing from this last week, and the reason why this video is coming on Wednesday instead of Tuesday, is I, after the woodworking show, um, Zach Her Herberholst and Johnny Brook and I all went up to uh, Johnny's house. So the, the three of us are from the Crafted Podcast, and if you're ever into podcasts, uh, you got to look that up. I'll leave a link to the podcast down, down below. Uh, but the three of us decided to do a one-day build, and all three of us, for about seven hours, made a coffee table with a live edge and a sliding drawer and a steel leg and so each of us got to bring in our own uh, specialties whereas uh, Zach got to do some metal work and I got to do some hand tool dovetails and uh, Johnny got to do the slab work and doing a waterfall with a modern look on it. Uh, really a lot of fun and I'm looking forward to that video. It should be coming out in a couple weeks um, and all three of us will have our part of the, uh, the video out. While we were there in Asheville, we got to go to Asheville Hardware where I picked up another slab. Uh, this is a beautiful piece of cherry, um, a deep, deep color. And I'm looking forward to turning this into a, uh, um, a table. I'm not exactly sure what I want to do. I'm thinking about doing a river, river table with it. But uh, yeah, that should be kind of fun. Uh, if you're ever in Asheville, the Asheville hardware is phenomenal. Um, I was seriously blown away with what was there. Uh, really, really cool place. And great price on slabs. But I also got, to, uh, I got a fro. So I'm looking forward to using this. I'm going to be doing uh, probably a few videos on uh, riving uh, timber out of logs. And uh, so, yeah, I've been wanting a fro for a while. A good chance to get one. So, hee <laughs> Videos for this next week. Uh, tomorrow, Wednesday, uh, Thursday, I'm going to be doing a video on making router planes. And I actually have four of these that I'm making. Uh, one of them is going to be the giveaway prize uh, for the 20,000 subscriber, which will be this uh, Sunday, I think it is, when I actually do the drawing. So if you want to win one of these router planes, um, you can find out more about that. I'll leave a link to the video um, describing how you can win one. And this is open to anyone in the world, any country, any place. I will ship out this router. So I'm really looking forward to giving away a hand router. This will actually be another collaboration with another woodworking channel. Um, not only wood, he is making the cutters for these. So you can see another way of making the, uh, the irons for a router plane. Other things coming up. I've had a lot of people asking me about doing the tool build off uh, for 2017. Last year we did a tool build off. Um, everyone who wanted to enter uh, made a tool and then we shipped them off to uh, a new people who would want them um, in a, a giveaway format. And it was a great time for other people to get into it and show off other people making hand tools. Um, and I'm really looking forward to doing that again this year. So that will actually be uh, through the, I'm thinking the month of June. We'll see. It's still up in the air. There's a lot of things figuring out. So I'm currently collecting sponsors for this. If you would like to sponsor a prize um, and put your name out there, I would love 
able to uh, put that up. Um, I'm looking for probably around uh, six to ten prizes to give away for this. It is a big thing, and there are a lot of uh, a lot of fun prizes to give away. So, uh, if you'd like to be entered in that, uh, let me know. And otherwise, stay tuned for more information. On top of that, Mitch Peacock, who runs the uh, Tool Make Challenge, uh, we're going to be doing them at the same time. So, if you make a tool for my project, you can also enter it into his competition. So, in making one, you can actually be entered into two competitions, which is phenomenal. And it's vice versa. If you make a tool for his project that then fits into the categorization of making a hand tool, uh, then you can also enter it in my uh, giveaway as well. So this should be a lot of fun. I do want to show off a, a few of the viewer projects, and this is kind of a cool thing. Uh, Jason Roche I hope I'm saying that right. I made this pencil box with a slide on lid. Really, really well done. It was his first kind of experiment with a few things, and I, I am blown away. Awesome finish on that, and uh, I know it's going to be a, a really, really cool gift to give away. And then Aaron Ionta sent me pictures of this carving in cottonwood bark. Um, really, really cool. One of these days I want to get into carving cottonwood bark. If you haven't done that, it's kind of fun. It's a, a fairly simple wood. Um, and holds a, a structure really well. Um, man, you did an awesome job on that. Um, kudos. Uh, looking forward to seeing what you make in the future. This month in the Patreon monthly giveaway, um, I'm giving away this Stanley number no. zero um, level, and it's I did some restoring on it. A lot of people asked me if I did the video on restoring this. Um, unfortunately, the footage for that was corrupted, and I am sorry. Uh, maybe I'll do another one here sometime in the future. But this is actually going to be going to Jeffrey Hall. Um, so, Jeffrey, you are the uh, the new owner of this. Let me know what your address is, and I will get that shipped out to you. Um, if you want to be entered into the Patreon giveaway uh, prizes, I do one every month where I give away anything, you know, uh, a saw, a hand tool, something for my shop, something I've restored. Um, all you have to do is be a patron on Patreon. So I'll leave a link to that in the description below. So that's about it for this week. A lot of things going on. I'm looking forward to getting the dresser up and running. Um, and, uh, well, I don't know if it'll ever be running. It's rather heavy for that. <laughs> but uh, I'm hoping to get it upstairs here soon and have some fun with that. Um, if you have any questions or comments, ideas, I'd love to hear those. Please let me know in the comments below. If you did like this video, please hit like and smash that subscribe button. Also want to say an incredible thank you to the patrons on Patreon. If you'd like to be entered into one of the monthly giveaways or find out more about that, you can click the link right over here. Also, if you like the video, feel free to check out one of my others. You might find something you like there. And until next time, have a wonderful day.